uh, washing the MSA G1 mask. Uh, this would be the process if it was heavily used on a fire, it's been sweat in, it's, it's very dirty. Uh, for a light cleaning, we'll have the, the cloths that you can wipe it down with to decontaminate. Uh, there's no electronics in here, so we wash these basically the same way we did the survivor mask. Um, we've got a bucket of warm water with very little uh, mild dish soap, some Dawn dish detergent, just a few drops filled with warm water. I'm going to fully submerge the mask. I'm going to agitate it. I'm going to get the, the uh, head net, kind of scrub it around a little bit. If the mask is, is really dirty, we've got these sponges. They're uh, kept on the wall by the, by the uh, wash rack materials where the old red caps used to be for the second stage regulators. So there's some new sponges. We use these to wipe down the interior, wipe out the nose cup, wipe out the inside of the face shield, wash down the outside of it, get it nice and clean. Okay. Um, if it's really dirty, you can pull out, pull out the nose cup, wash it separately, use the nap, uh, use the uh, sponge on it. Okay. And then, if you need to, you can pull out the. Come in close, Jason. You can you can pull out the inhalation valve right here, okay, and you can wash that separately, and then to put it back in, you're gonna put in the the front first, line it up, and then it'll snap into place. Okay, it's a little tricky. There we go. Okay, after I've, after I've washed it in the soapy water, uh, I'm going to give it a little bit of a rinse. And then I'm going to take it inside to the uh, sink and give it a, a good warm water rinse to make sure I've got all the soap residue out. It is important to make sure you don't have a, a really soapy uh, wash water. It does not need to have a lot of soap. So I'm going to take that in. I'm going to exercise the valve. Uh, make sure the exhalation valve is flushed out and then I've got the cleaning solution this is the confidence plus this is basically like cavicide so I'll give it a good spray with this and let it sit to really disinfect it. I got some warm water here I'm just gonna rinse it one more time I gave it a good rinse outside with the hose the important part of this stage is rinsing the exhalation valve so if you remember we have the little white stem down here what I want to do is use a pen or something similar and push that little white stem in and exercise that valve in and out and I'm going to do that while I'm flowing water over it and make sure it gets really well flushed and there's no soap residue. Okay. After I'm done rinsing the mask really well, if it needs disinfecting, I'm going to use the mask cleaning spray wet it very liberally, let that sit. Uh, recommended time to let this sit is 10 minutes and it pretty much kills everything. Viruses, bacteria. After it sits for 10 minutes, I'm gonna give it another rinse with warm water and then let it air dry. And that's it.